putting this in the round is a genius solution to making this comedy stick. And it gets the audience in on all the jokes. It can be really funny. And I think this production is going to be very funny. My name is Kim Powers. This is my second show with Florida Rep. I did Morning After Grace last year and I was excited to be brought back. So I, I started just doing the normal research that I would do on a period show. So I'm looking at, since Oscar Wilde was one of the key figures of the aesthetic movement, I just started looking up aesthetic interiors. And I found the Peacock Room. It, it's one of the few surviving aesthetic interiors that exists. So we're actually, I believe in the Smithsonian right now. I'm Julie McCracken. I'm the scenic paint charge at the Florida Repertory Theater. Um, so to create this mural, we used uh, Kimberly Power's lovely design. We spent about four days. Initially, we had to put down base coat, uh, which is this scumble of teals. And then once that was dry and ready, we began by sort of outlining or cartooning the main bodies of the, the peacocks. And a little secret we used for that was that we had our uh, lighting team mount a couple of overhead projectors so that we could figure out exactly where we wanted them to sit on the floor. And um, after we cartooned or outlined the main shape of the peacock's bodies, we went back in and added all of the details, extended the wings, the tail feathers, and then also did the border uh, using a combination of stencils and stamps to create this lacy pattern with the, the gold metallic paint that, that we love using. <laughs> Well, because it's in the round, we don't have to pretend that this is real in any way. This sort of gave us the freedom to, to go look at this research and pull something completely sort of abstract out of it. Because what we do know is that the actors will be interacting with real pieces of furniture, so those have to be real. We're changing location three times during the show, so we need to make sure that it feels real enough, feel like a world for the characters to take to live in but it has to also feel like a little bit of an idyllic space, a little bit over the top, a little like the Victorian lace you would see on some of the dresses. It just has to feel extra.